that is so exciting right now. The fans we're coming in here today, they're really involved in this team. They're liking what they're seeing. A great four game win streak after a tough little start to the road trip. But being back at home, bringing that energy here at the ballpark, I'll tell you what, it is fun. Home opener. It's Griffin Canning, a local kid who gets the start on opening night. Boston Red Sox tonight, Jaron Duran. And in the home opener, his first pitch is popped up by Jaron Duran. A fast man to keep off the bases as Zach Neto makes the catch. One pitch, one out for Cannon. He just wanted to bring that suspense for the fans here today. Get that pop up, that quick out. And that one almost hit him. And he checked his swing on the appeal, so it'll be ball four. Trevor Story, the batter, with one out and a runner on first. Story is finally healthy. He off the end of his bat, lifts a fly ball, and Mike Trout in right center field in front of the home fans again makes the catch for the second out. Here's Yoshida. Strike three call to Yoshida. Griffin Canning puts up a zero in the top of the first. Right hander cutter Crawford looking for his first victory of the season. As Anthony Rendon steps up. Past him. He struck him out. And an 0 for 20 beginning to the season as Anthony Rendon heads back to the Angels dugout. Sean Owell has his streak intact. At 35 consecutive games. That's in there. He froze him for strike three. Red Sox continue to pile up K's, don't they? Back to back strikeouts by Crawford. Don't forget the first inning of last year's home opener. Trout crushed one off the Blue Jays' Chris Bassett. Popped up sky high. Right through the silo. And here's McGuire. He's got it. Crawford, quick start. One, two, three, go to Halos in the first inning. Tyler O'Neill 333 has a little five game hitting streak going. He'll hammer a high fly to the right center backing up Trout still backing up now he's turning and that's gone home run. Tyler O'Neill with number three. Nice way to extend that hitting streak to six consecutive games he's reached in every game so far this season with his new club and the Red Sox lead in one zip. And brings up Tristan Casas at 192 looking for his first home run. There's a high fly ball left center field deep. Trout backing up all the way to the wall. Kiss it goodbye. The Red Sox go back to back. Number one for Tristan Casas. Red Sox flexing some muscle here in Southern California. Yeah, that's big too. We talked about a little bit about the OPS being down. Well, they delivered back to back home runs. And yeah, oh, that no. one drills him. He gets hit on the arm of the hand. And Sadon immediately removes that helmet. He is in some pain here. He's going to stay in? He is. This is a great sign. And here's Reese McGuire, 333 without a home run. Holding immediately. This is swinging a drive right field. This is a shot. Oniak back. Yes, sir. The Red Sox with their third home run in the second inning. Reese McGuire tattoos one to right. His first home run of the season. And the Sox are off to the races here in Cali. Three home runs in the second to take a 4 nothing lead just like that. And one out. Masataki Yoshida will dig in next. He struck out looking at the first inning. Toward the right side. That'll kick through for a base hit. Mas is on. He's one for two tonight. Passes with the fine eye. First and second. Valdez 0 for 1. And Griffin Canning works his way through the third with a strikeout of N. Manuel Valdez. Oh, Hoppy, one of the hottest hitters in baseball. Oh, Hoppy going up the middle. Story with the spin. The throw. Got it. Long way to go, but he's made a couple of dazzling plays this season just like that. We didn't see this play made all last year until he arrived. Yeah, we've seen him make a lot of great plays to his right, this one to his left. You may have heard some boos coming out of that ID. It's for Anthony Rendon. Crawford nods his head. Tenth pitch of the at-bat, swing and a pop-up. Looks like it's playable behind first base. Casas ranges back, straddling the foul line. He'll make the grab. And Cutter Crawford has a 1-2-3 third inning. He's gotten there on just 43 pitches. Nolan Shanoel who hit a home run on the Angels road trip. The Angels struck eight homers on that trip. Three each from Mike Trout and Taylor Ward. They are due up after Shanoel here in the fourth inning. And that could be it down the line, but foul. Soft bouncer to the mound as Crawford plays his position. And Nolan Shanoel bounces out. Now he's got to deal with Mike Trout. Popped out to the catcher his first time. Hot shot. Done. Play by story, but he cannot. Oh no. Oh, he's oh, in no. He's in pain here. He is writhing in agony and had a hand on his shoulder. He made a sensational stop on it. He was not going to get it out and landed on that shoulder, apparently. This is so unfortunate to me. To even put a glove on that was spectacular, and then he's going down to on that shoulder. One-two on the way. 
Down he goes and the throw to first not in time. A strikeout at the plate for out number two as Trout went sprawling back in there. Now here in Southern California. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Back to back strikeouts. So that is all one left. And the Angels have their leadoff man on. Moniac's game, and if you look at numbers and power, so if he gets one in his own, I, I anticipate him swinging. And that's going to be in there. Caught him looking. Strike three, made a great pitch. That was a terrific pitch. That was on the black. And the bases are loaded. Nolan Shonowell is due up, and here comes Andrew Bailey to chat with Crawford, who's in a jam. The Angels would love a grand slam here. Mike Trout on deck. Nolan Shotwell gets an RBI. His streak is at 36. The Angels are on the board, and Cutter Crawford is headed for the shower. And Weiser, the right-hander, inherits a mess. And this crowd is electrified. And now it's Trout. And he's going to throw that. He throws a slider. And he also throws a sinker. And a high fly ball, right center field, but room out there. Rafaela says he'll take it, and he's got it. They leave them loaded. Weiser does his job. It is four to one. And a good start for the Red Sox. Raffaello with his speed is aboard. Runner goes. Swung on and missed. The throw down. The tag out. Oh, headset. Yeah, he'd like to see a challenge here. Yeah, this is close. Yep. He did. This is going to come back. That's going to be a stolen base. Should be anyway. Ball is overturned. The runner is safe. Boston will retain their challenge. 2-2. Two -two. Hard hit. Base hit into right center. That'll chase in a run. Raffaello will score. Duran stays hot. The Red Sox are on top five to one. Six stolen bases for him. He's not running. And oh, that one's no. Jeez. Get him, I think it did. This is a bizarre night, isn't it? I mean, Raffi getting hit here. Sadon got hit earlier. Trevor Story had to leave the game after a diving play. And he's going to take his base. Hit by the pitch. Chopper up the middle as Neto flips to second for the four sound. That ends the inning. Taylor Ward, it's a line drive. Smacked it pretty good, but he dropped. Rafaela drops the ball. Wow. Taylor Ward gets a gift. No, he's not really controlling I that never baseball had at all. No. Comes to third as Devers grabs it, gets it to second, and that's, that's a problem. Problem. Wow. Everybody's safe. And the defensive woes of the Red Sox have reemerged. That got him. That hits Sano. So now the bases are loaded, and the Angels have another scoring chance. Now one away, and it's Logan Ohapi due up. 5 1 Red Sox, bases loaded. Ohapi, it's a high fly ball. Rafaela is back. He's still going. He's up near the wall, and it's gone! A grand slam! Logan Ohapi ties it on opening night. Boy, you want to be a leader? That's how you lead. And leave. For a grand slam to tie it up. Logan, oh, hammered. They made the second most errors in baseball. As Rendon trying to leg out his first hit of the year. He's safe. That's the beauty of baseball right there. Standing O on an infield knock for Anthony Rendon. They've got runners on the corners, just one down in a tie ball game here in the seventh. High fly center field, driving back Trout. Makes the catch, tagging up on the other. Here he comes. Easily in to score the go ahead run, and the Red Sox are back in front six to five. Valdez with his fifth RBI of the season. He's done that a couple of times now where he's made sure to get that run in. <laughs> that was nasty. I guess it was a sinker. Runners at first and second, one out, the tying run at second base. And oh, it's a ground ball, base hit to left. War is being waved home. Here comes Duran's throw to the plate. It is not in time. The game tied again. Miguel Sano and RBI at 6 6. Duran one for four, base hit. Fly center field. Trout racing back. Trout racing back. And he can keep on running because it's gone. And the Red Sox retake the lead. Jaron Duran over the head of Mike Trout. Wow, that was huge right there for Jaron Duran. I haven't seen him drove the ball like that. I mean, he is just, he is pumped. That is a hot bat. He's swinging. And one gone in the ninth. In front of Tyler O'Neill. Swinging a drive out to left field. Backing up board on the run to the wall. He's done it again. Another home run for O'Neill. Tyler O'Neill with a line drive over the head of Ward and gone. Second home run of the night. Looked like it was a changeup. Left it up.
Now the baseball goes into the hand of Big Kenley Jansen. Kenley trying to lock this one up from number 423. Trying to put the capper on what's been a pretty zany night. Swing and a foul tip to the mid strike three. And the Red Sox win the game eight to six. They power their way to a win. Kenley with 423 saves. One away from John Franco. O'Neill just terrific again with two home runs. Red Sox hit five.